So this will be the last uh, exercise for our first part in the uh, extremum problem, which is the first derivative test. Um, so if you notice the pattern in our notes, um, we have uh, whenever we come across with one example, then we, we will have an exercise uh, following right after it, where it is a complete uh, duplicate uh, as in the previous example but with a different value or function so that you will have uh, ample or more exercises and examples that you can refer to for your understanding okay so as in given in the question uh, we have over here y is equal to x divided by x plus 1 square so this one for you to differentiate it you simply have to use a quotient rule hopefully you don't have any problem with your basic differentiation so you have 1 minus x divided by x plus 1 to the power of uh, 3 over here after a lot of simplification and let this equals to 0 and we can solve for x which is x equal to 1 and when x is equal to 1 the y will equals to 1 over 4 so that will be our stationary point that we are looking for so if you notice this will be a little bit simpler as opposed to the previous example since we only have to deal with one point so only one table of shape of tangent is enough to complete this question Okay, so this is our x, uh, it, it will be 1, I am choosing 1 half over here, although you can use 2, uh, because you will not uh, be, you will not make this y undefined by using a 1, as well as z, can we use 0, no, 0 is not usable over here, is it? No, you can use 0 over here, we are looking at the wrong thing, we, we should be looking at here, uh, because it's going to be the one that we will use to calculate this row okay so this will be our dy dx so putting one obviously we'll get a zero putting a one half you get a negative something so we are only interested in the sign uh, the same thing with 0 0.5 let's leave that to your calculators and this is increase this is a horizontal and this is a decreasing line okay so if you notice that we use this um, a little bit short in the earlier tables it's okay but do not be confused with a negative sign the, a shorter version of this line will simply be a dash line uh, meaning we are looking at the shape of tangent and not at any value or any sign so now we can write our conclusion this one will be our relative maximum point So with that, um, we are going to look into the next part in this particular subtopic in the following uh, notes. So that will be a second derivative test and what comes along with it.